Howdy folks, Law Abiding Minnesotan here with North Central Minnesota Press, coming at you from near Baudette, Minnesota. As you guys might have seen from my last couple of videos, I was cleaning my guns uh, in preparation for a hunting trip, and here I am out in the stand. Uh, I didn't get any video this morning because, you know, I just went back in for lunch here about an hour ago and just got back out to my stand. So I figured this would be a good time to shoot a video before things really get real. It's about 12.30 in the afternoon right now. So I just got back up in my stand. We're going to have to wait them out here. Um, just to show you guys around a little bit here. I'm in my, in my deer stand here. We got the buck crossing out there. And we got the West Fork. Baudette River, and that bed that runs all along there, and out in front of me to the east here, you got uh, what used to kind of be a field, but it's kind of grown over now. Uh, they plan on doing some more cutting through here, so you clear that field out a little bit better, and then we got off to the north, we got Woodline, and we don't get busted out by one back there. We got a little protection from, from that and I can hear them back there. So tough to get a shot through the trees back there, but uh, it's doable. And these deer can come from any direction closer to my house um, where I've been hunting the last few years. We kind of set up in a particular direction expecting deer to come from a certain way, but up here they can come from absolutely anywhere. Um, we have, there's a field about, I don't know, maybe a couple hundred yards that way, probably two, three hundred yards that way that they, uh, up to the north here, that they like to eat in at night. And they kind of mosey along that river bank all the way back down there to the west. Um, So yeah, I just wanted to update you guys. I know I had a viewer or two that wanted to wanted to see um, where I was taking those guns I was cleaning. So here you have it. Uh, Got to keep the volume down a little. Don't want to bust anything out of here. I don't think I would at 12:30 in the afternoon. I just got back up here, making a bunch of noise getting back up here. And uh, but you never know. Sometimes you jump back up in your stand and 20 minutes later you get shot. So I'm just kind of paying attention while I'm shooting this video. Um, and deer hunting's kind of goofy, you know. Uh, the minute you're not paying attention, one walks right through. And so I'm gonna be particularly watching that riverbed can't really see into the crossing too good with those trees, but they should be coming. That provides me with a little cover too, so they won't see me, but they're the shooting lane right through there towards the river. I got, I got, this is cleared out a little bit in front of me here to the east. I got a little bit of scruff with another shooting lane down there. I suppose it'd be northeast, that direction's northeast, that's more like straight north there. So we're kind of faced east between, you know, you got from the north, there's east, and down to the south. So that's what we got going on here. Um, stay tuned because if I get one, I'll be shooting another video. I just wanted to shoot a quick video update you it's about 12 30 uh just afternoon right now on saturday i believe it's the 5th of november uh opening deer hunting and so i'm gonna go ahead and shut the camera off and get settled in here and wait for something to come through and hopefully you guys will hear from me soon uh, by a minnesotan with north central minnesota press out